coming in again. So I just wanted to share with you, as you can see by the title, how and why I chose to eat my um, afterbirth, my placenta with the birth of my son. He was born in May of this year. And prior to giving birth, I really just spent so much time, as I'm sure every mom does, researching like what's the best for my son, what's the best for me, how to have a natural birth, just every possible thing you can think of. Something that I came across that I totally was like, totally, I just didn't even know people did this, was um, ingesting your placenta. So um, in our area, I feel like eating it raw is like, that's totally weird. Like that's like, oh my gosh, why would you do that? So what a lot of people in my area do, I live in Maryland, is placenta encapsulation, which is basically dehydrating it dehydrating it, putting it into capsules and taking it that way. For me though, that just seemed like such a long process, like totally time consuming and more expensive whenever it, uh, the point is to just get it into your body. So what I chose to do was after I had my son, um, my husband, who's amazing, he basically would just um, every day, at least once or twice a day for like about a week, he would um, cut up some of it, like the meaty parts, I don't know how to explain it, um, cut up some of it and put it into smoothies for me. So the way that I did my smoothies was frozen berries, organic, um, agave nectar, placenta, and I think he may have put almond milk. I can't remember, but I think he may have put almond milk in there. Oh, and some ice. So that is what he would make for me every day. And about each smoothie would have about a cup of placenta in it. But honestly, like I couldn't taste it at all. Like I couldn't taste it. All I tasted was the berries. Um, and they were really good. So, but I would just down them. So. Yeah, I had those for about the first week postpartum, and, um, you know, I've never had any other birth. I, you know, he's my first child, so I can't, I don't know if this is just how it was going to be for me, or if the placenta played any part in it, but for me at least, um, I did experience after the birth of my son, the bleeding was not bad at all. I feel like um, that is supposed to be one of the benefits, and... For me, in my experience, I didn't have like a ton of bleeding and I feel like it didn't last that long. It maybe lasted about a week or two and then, you know, after that there would just be some like discolored, colored like discharge and stuff, but it really, it wasn't like that at all. Um, and the next thing was my energy level, my mood, my milk supply. So everything that ingesting your placenta is supposed to help with, um, I did experience. So my milk came in and I actually made a video on oversupply and I had great, great, a great milk supply um, and, I, and I still do but like so especially after you know in that first six weeks I you know produced plenty of milk, I had a great time breastfeeding um, and then my energy and my mood, I didn't experience any postpartum depression until um, I had to go back to work and that like I was just sad because I had to go back to work but other than that I didn't experience postpartum depression and then the only other thing yeah my energy so I just remember after having my son and I, I stayed in the bedroom for the first three days and I was just so just happy and just giggly and just super joyful for a really long time and as far as energy I mean like I've said before we do co-sleep we've always co-slept and so I feel like that definitely played a part in it, but I was never super drained or super tired. I did always feel pretty well rested and um, yeah, just overall wonderful. And so even though I can't, you know, scientifically say that it's because I ate my placenta, um, I do know that I'll be doing it in the future because for me, I had a great postpartum period. So, yeah, if you guys have any questions about it, definitely ask me in the comment section below. And I would love to do a follow-up video on this because I am totally for it. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching.